Hey everyone, welcome to Sauce and welcome back to Strider. I say it's time to go finish this. Let's uh finish this. You know? Let's go over to Mayo and be like, hey Mayo, you're kind of a rude guy. You're kind of rude, you know? You should probably stop. Ah uh, yes, the non-interactive dodging sequence. Also, what the hell is up with this? It just back gets all black. I don't get it. Ding. So this place is a bit hectic. You just called me a heretic? I think he called me a heretic there. He have way too much health. What the hell? have that much health that one time. Oh, the statue turns. What is this, Resident Evil? You gotta turn the statue 25 degrees up uh, around so that it will turn and then uh, put the coin on the statue's eye and then it will be like, hey, you can open this door now. What? Who rigged the door to the statue? Who did that? Who would do that? Just. Why? There's an item up here. Oh, I can't. Okay. I suppose I'll have to get it later because I feel like I should ra ration out my usage of the items. The uh, canisters. Just in case. I, I feel I feel like I'm gonna need help pick up some point um, is there any point to me going up like this I don't know come on ah I'm not heretic dude get the freak frack up there oh there's this is a platform. And look at how much damage that one guy's burst did to me.
damn. So many, so much mashing. I like how I got stuck in the middle of uh, my pain wisp, like, sound effect uh, Strider makes when he's in pain. That was silly. Um. So, how do we reach that now? Get those items. I don't even know if I, like, We'll come back to this main place later. I probably, probably will. Yeah, let me go back to. Oh, we will say right away that I don't like these enemies. Oh, of course. Third. Third. Oh. Well, there's nothing in here, right? In terms of things I have to collect. I assume not. Now it's open. Orbital power lift. Lift power, I mean. I'm just gonna go up here, whatever. I don't care. All those guys. Thankfully those guys here don't respawn, that would be annoying. Let me get these things. I might as well. Back down.
I think I seriously missed that one canister. It sucks. I really should have known better than to try hopping over the plat the, the elevator. It never works like you expect it to. That was a waste of a charge. Seventy. Seventy. This sucks. I sh was supposed to have ninety. A hundred. I mean. You have done us a great service, young Strider. We thank you for dealing with my subordinates. We had grown tired of their incompetence. The people of this planet have squandered the gifts we gave them. All of their imperfections and weaknesses have given us clarity. We will start anew and bring about the new age of mayhem. No. Come, Strider. You will serve me. You will help us reshape this world. I will not serve you or any other dead man. Disappointing. And so imperfect. Shut this up. world is mine, Strider. If you will not serve me, you will die. Shut up, Palpatine. Lord of Darkness. that projectile. Oh, I guess I can attack it. I don't see any way to get rid of that projectile. You have done us it can skip this? Service, wow, this game! I can skip this. Support. Oh, I can't, never mind. Alright, good.
Escalated quickly. How do I attack this? I guess I can am attacking it. If I use the temporal kunai, only one of them gets attached. Controls uh, around these things make it so hard to understand what's going on. Like they just... Like look at this, I'm holding left. I'm holding right. I'm holding right! <laughs> I'm just... So freaking confusing! no time for you to make it over there. Punish that guy. Okay. 
okay. Ow. I'm dead. Uh, this is a very dull boss fight because the, the movement is so com the movement is so confusing and the projectiles are just so hard to keep track of. What the? Okay. Thankfully, the explosive and I are legit broken. How does this keep happening? Also, I don't understand why you're using default boss music instead of the special music for the boss fight, the final boss. I do not understand what's going on. I don't understand where I'm going. Is that it? Is it dead, Jim? I think it's dead, Jim. That wasn't terrible hard. So I got the gist of it. It's still a bit annoying. The movement is so misleading and confusing. And that's it. it. Just ends right there. Okay. I mean, I can't complain. It's like, yeah, mission accomplished. Doesn't need to show me the aftermath of anything, like leaving an entire country without its leadership. That's easy. That's uh, that's simple, right? Nobody cares, really. Uh, I guess. Uh, I I don't know. It's not. This game was fun. It just got a little annoying by the end, but, you know? It was still alright. Can't complain too much. I will complain about being taken away from the ability to get 100% completion because of the freaking elevator warping me away from above, but that's I shouldn't have seen that coming. I really should have seen that coming. And I quit I can probably do that again in a bit. Just to get the achievement. Because there obviously is an achievement for getting all the uh Hey it's my it's sauce it's sauce. Look it's me. Mike Sosido. No that's not me. Uh I don't know.
I think I missed it. Was there? Okay, uh, uh, of course. Aside from the uh, voice actresses, was there any, were there any women involved in the making of this game? I couldn't, pay, I couldn't pay attention. I couldn't tell, honestly. But okay. So maybe there was a a name from a different nationality that I didn't recognize as a female, like that Sung, Sung. But that, I don't know. Striderpedia. Striderpedia. Damn fans. Oh, there are some women at the entertain at the Foundation Nine Entertainment, but other than that, I don't know. Liz the Liz Diawadi, Liz Diawadi. That's a different name. Kind of cool. Kinda neat, I guess. way through this so I can show the the other things the extras one of these names in quality assurance doesn't fit I don't know which one if you can figure out which one but I think one of them doesn't really fit with the with the rest Kinda unusual, but okay. You know what? Fine. Why does Capcom, Capcom USA have more Japanese names than Capcom Japan? I mean, the first... I don't know. This name is guy's Bacon? This guy's name is Bacon? Nice. Neat. Crabtree! Also an unusual name, but okay. Pretty cool. That's a lot of quality assurance. Okay. What's with the inconsistency here? Alicia Kim is up to the left, and then the Laura Skelly's name is to the right of her uh, assignment a a attribution. What? What a weird inconsistency. It is kind of my job to point out inconsistencies like that and fix them. So, you know, I tend to lock on to those. Oh yes, W wise. Havoc. Neat. Havoc has been in use for a while, huh? Even Dark Souls uses it. Alt Japan. Localization, okay. Nice. Figs means French, Italian, German, and Spanish, by the way. I thought I would let you know. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, okay. I guess that's it. Mission accomplished. Hero's mission is complete. Would you like to save your game? I don't want to save my game if I'm gonna need to start over because I didn't get the 100%. I need to do that again so I can get the 100%. Because of one freaking uh, canister. Let's look at the concept arts then. Here in Glider, right ab high above Kazakh City. Oh, it doesn't let me scroll through them. Start a hero concept. Was he supposed to have a laser uh, sight? Alright. Reverse lightning effect. Straight zoom effect. Energy absorbing. Oh, okay, I get it. In, in the end, they ended up putting the energy towards the top left where the health bars are, so it didn't matter. I like the, the one on the top though, the reverse lightning effect. That's pretty cool. Pick up container. The cradle, cradles. Novo. This gate switch. Oh, nice. Different gate switches, but I don't think they ended up using this. City gate. Yeah. Cues from previous games. How many previous games are there? I thought there were like one <laughs> Strider game. Underground Zone Concepts. I mean, Strider must have been in several games. I suppose. I don't know what, what all of them are. Missile Launcher. Electroshock. Skiffs. Oh, those things. I think it's really inefficient to use an entire vehicle to carry four soldiers around. It's just me, though. It's just my, my uh, opinion. I like how they put in a Strider Hero for scale. Heavy machine gun. Flamethrower. Seeker missiles. They, don't, they, didn't end, they didn't use the heavy machine gun. Hell, they didn't have any... Uh, any of these. The only one... I guess that there was there were some that threw the... Little napalm bombs, but most of them just had the... That mace thing they show, shoot out. I don't really get the ball thing, but okay. Concepts taking games name cues from past games for option A. Alright. Mail's tower, rough, okay. Let me show that again. Uh, it's a bit rough, yeah. But yeah, that looks okay. Interfaces. Alright. Yeah, that's I think that's what the ended up being. Military ring where Kazak City meets the military ring, yeah. Turrets. Flat top meatball turrets. Meatball turrets. Solo. The bounty hunter, yeah, that's not that's not a reference or anything. Solo 2 revived. Oh now he has the broken uh visor. Yeah. Why does he have ostrich legs? What the hell? He gets mad and shoots at Strider who is known for reflecting bullets at people like a clever man. Mecha tank. Who cares made to invent a tank befitting a Strider game? Yeah, that seemed fitting. I don't know what would fit a Strider game. I've only played the one. Peanut weapons. Peanuts? I see, they do have a bunch of weapons. The Pooh Sisters. Unknown well fighters from previous Strider games, huh? Neat. Dragon storyboards. Second armor dragon story. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Jurong. That guy is cool. Plasma ring, catapult ring concept, right? Military tank, 
Millipede. Multi-eye organism. Several sewer crabs join together. Okay, that's kind of annoying, honestly. <laughs> but I can see it. I can definitely see it. Who's the head, though? Where did the head come from? Or the tail? That doesn't... That, that's not very well explained. Sorry, Bart, for Millipede attacks. Okay. That sounds painful. Oh, the, uh, the drip drip leading to Strider getting smashed by the thing. They would. No, oh, there was a point where it would separate in several forms, se several creatures, like it's uh, supposed to do. I mean, like this implies it's made of several sewer crabs. Mutant version of the peanut. Yeah, that four is pretty spooky. That's a very spooky peanut. Interest in Aragon Temple. Neat. Aragon Dump. The most memorable enemies from the original game. The big gorilla. The Queen Mother of the West uses all the Pooh Sisters' powers. So I guess you can just copy and paste those things on the left, on the right, onto the body of the left. I suppose that's what's supposed to be, like drag and drop over them, fit them in, painting at the airship, airship Balrog. That's a really cool airship. And laser turrets. Brainwalker. Ballistic Flower. That's a cool name. I can see it. I think I can see it. Research facility interior concepts. Interior concepts. Mayo. Um, I don't know why this is locked. Oh. Light armor and custom rifles are prepared for any civil disturbance. Peanut. Oh man, that's a lot of text. Yeah, I guess you need to care for those. I don't have any water anymore. Combat protocol protocols. The Ouroboros. I can't spin it. Heavy trooper. Constant headache for the other two. Yin Yang Zhao Zhao Hook Sword. Okay. Oh dang! Look at that. He has a big rocket launcher. Hotengeki. Weapon of choice. Signature whirlwind attack. Yep. Peanut. Xanthaps. They are programmed for it, then I assume they are really robots. Molnia. Rose. The prisoner. It's, it's just it's just junk junk rat. It's just junk rat. Yeah, there's the shields are strong. Seven seven Z. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, they, they revived the, the soldiers? Okay. Black Marketer. Tone 
Lokaku. Lokaku Butterfly Sword. Here's the here's the man himself. Those legs are still kind of weird to me, but okay. I guess. Yeah, I guess it did augment his body. We can augment the thing's na natural rotation with our own. Oh, the millipede. failed to kill anything. He's, his targets never escaped. I can buy it. Multiple layers of armaments and hover jets for all terrain mobility. Plasma harnessing shield, yeah, okay. Oh, they, they, they uh, zap. They do a zap. Where the Schlange designed this large walking turret. That's smart enough to think strategically in intense combat situations. Ultra Cold Trooper. Yeah, that's fair. Who'd I got? She Young She Wang Mu. Okay. Transcendental. Oh, the Inferno revived. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. That's spooky. Oh yeah. You're wrong. Bing. Oh yeah. Dystopian city Kazakh. Okay. Feels of modern convenience. Feel a sense of freedom through conformity. Oh, there they are. Dang. Black market. Oh yeah, the insect troopers, I guess, are over there. They use mechanical might. Airship Balrog. Oh, the Striders. I've seen these. Uh, I believe I will go finish the game with 100% and then see if that unlocks the rest of the the last uh, intel that I couldn't see. So I'll be back in a bit. Alright, that's a little better. <laughs> Let's see if I got the extras that I was missing before. Mayo Prime. A oh, Mayo. Mayo Prime. Side view. 
Does it say dungeon? Dragon? It says dragon. Um, yeah, that's where the dragons pop out. Yeah. The origins of Mayor are unknown, but it suddenly appeared on Earth and became its supreme ruler in a few short years. He be an alien, hundreds of years old. War domination, the eradication of all human life on Earth, so he can build his utopian vision of the world. Grandmaster Mayo's final form is a massive space alien known as Mayo Prime. The form is concealed from the inhabitants of Earth, which is another world the creature of immense proportions. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is. It sure is. Uh, here it is, third moon base. Third moon ob orbits around the Earth and is large enough to be actually seen, to actually be seen from space, from the surface. I mean, it's both satellite from orbit and enter the Earth. Oh, oh, I don't like that at all. That doesn't sound fun. But yeah, I guess that's. Um, I guess that's it for Strider. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, this has been Sauce, and I'll see you next time on... Damn it. Damn it. Uh, there we go. I have a stat now. Uh, thanks for listening, this has been Sauce, and I'll see you next time on the channel, I guess. I don't know exactly how we'll record next, but I guess CrossCodes is still going, so that... Uh, bye!